What's up everyone, I'm Justin Tech. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to be telling you how to transfer your contacts from your iPhone to an Android device and vice versa. I just switched to an Android device and I needed to learn this, so I did. And I was like, I'm gonna make a video about it. So that's what I'm doing today. Make sure you guys like this video if it helps you out and let's get to it. First things first is you are going to need an iCloud account on your iPhone and a Gmail account linked to your Android device. As long as you have that, you are good to go. If you don't, make sure you guys create those accounts on each, of the, each device and then you're all set. First, let's start with iPhone users. Get your iPhone out and go to settings and make sure that right on top, your iCloud account is logged in. If it's not, click in there and then make sure you log in. Then next, go to iCloud. In here is all the information that is going into the cloud. You do get a standard amount of information that's allowed for free, so you should be good for to do this. Uh, make sure that contacts is switched on. That is all you need to do. Now your contacts from this phone are going to go into the cloud so that we can take them out and transport them. So after that, put down your iPhone and then go onto your computer and you're going to go to iCloud.com. This is where you're going to access the contacts. So you're gonna to have to sign in with your account, iCloud account. Once you're signed into iCloud, go to contacts. This is where all your contacts are stored. And next, go to the bottom left corner and click that little gear icon. Here is where you're going to export the V card. The V card contains all of the contacts. But before you do that, make sure you click in, in into your contacts and, and click Command A. That will highlight all of your contacts. Next, go to that gear in the bottom corner, export V card. And there you go. It exports right down there in the corner. If you have a Mac, that file is going to go into your downloads folder. Next, you need to go to Google. So go to google.com, make sure you sign in. I'm already signed in. And then once you're signed in to Google, which you'll, you'll sign in up in this, bottom, in this top corner, click this little, this little box art and go to contacts. This will take you to your Google contacts. So most likely this will be empty if, you're, if it's a brand new phone, if you've never put contacts in. Mine are already in there. But if they weren't, I'd go down on the side, scroll down and go to import. Here you're going to select the file and go to downloads. And then that is the file. And I'm not going to, but you would click open and voila, you've got your contacts on your Google phone. It will, on your Android phone. It will take some time for it to sync, but not that long. You should be seeing them come up very quickly. Now let's do this the opposite way. What if you have an Android phone and you're switching over to an iPhone? Very simple. So here I am on my Gmail contacts. I'm going to go to export now instead on the side. And here I'm gonna click V card because this is for iOS contacts and I'm going to export. This will also go in to the downloads folder. As you can see, if I go to my downloads, there it is. And if I click spacebar on it, it shows me all the contacts. Next, go back to iCloud. Go to that gear icon in the bottom left, click import vCard this time, and then go to that file and then you'd click open. There you guys have it. Be sure to like this video if it helped you out today. That way other people can find it and drop any lingering questions below in the comments. I come out with videos every Thursday, tech help, tech reviews, tech analysis, comparisons. So be sure to subscribe down below and click that bell for alerts. I'm Justin and I'll tech you later.